Hello and welcome. We're in wine country and I'm Mary Babbitt. When you visit wine country, wine tasting is probably at the top of your list of things to do. But hold your horses. A lot of other activities can be enjoyed here as well. We found a great wine country destination for the whole family, a miniature horse ranch. Come along on an adventure in wine country as we visit Quicksilver Ranch in California's San Ynez Valley. A lot of people come by us by accident. By 10 a.m. on most mornings, a small crowd is gathered at the gates of Quicksilver Ranch in California's famed Santa Ynez wine country. We'll actually have people waiting to come in. I feel like they're standing at the gate going, let us in, you know. Ranch hand Maria Bishop says most folks stumble across Quicksilver Ranch while touring wine country. Once they glimpse its pint-sized residence, they can't help but take a closer look. Go, go, go! <laughs> we breed miniature horses. A miniature horse is, as the name suggests, a small horse. <laughs> it's not that it's just little. They need to be in proportion to themselves. They have to be under 34 inches tall to be registered. The breed dates back to 17th century England, where miniature horses were bred as pets for royalty. When the novelty of them wore off, they sent them off to the mines to work. So they were actually imported to this country for the coal mines back east and used in the mines until about the mid-50s, and then somebody thought they were cute again. Good girl. Each horse is not the same. Each horse has a different personality, you know, and you have to figure out, you know, uh, to find out which way they work better. And that's what I try to, to do, you know. Come on, girl. They can pull two adults, easy. Good girl. Like 10 times the whole way they can pull. I mean, like nothing happened. Trainer Jose Luquin works with the minis, as they're often called, preparing those sold to new owners for their lives beyond the ranch. Come on, please. Every year, the ranch offers up around 30 miniature horses for sale. Most are bought as pets. <laughs> our boys, our little colts, will start at about $2,500. Stand still. Our fillies will start at about 4000 And then they go from there. Depending on size and color and quality, they can go up to ten, twelve thousand dollars $12,000. Good boy. Good boy, Blay. You're doing good, buddy. Of course, most folks visiting Quicksilver Ranch have no intention of buying a horse, but they get plenty of opportunities to see them up close. They're not shy. These animals are adorable. They're so cute. They're just so much fun. <laughs> the ranch makes for a memorable wine country stopover the whole family can enjoy. I've worked with large horses all my life, but the minis are, they're more like therapy. <laughs> They're so satisfying to work with. And there isn't a day go by that, as long as I've worked here even, that you don't go, oh my God, they're so cute. 